So uh, last year I undertook a six month internship in the Office for National Statistics in Newport. Um, I was working in the health analysis team, which was uh, a team of about six people. Um, I was working on a project looking at the difference in the life expectancies of the richest and the poorest people in the UK. Slightly different topic to my PhD. My PhD, my PhD was relevant to health inequalities in general, but it wasn't um, relevant to that specific niche. But what it let me do is really develop my um, statistical skills. And also it um, enabled me to learn a lot about working with uh, policy makers and people who have the potential to really make a difference to um, policy decisions in the UK, which isn't an experience I'd had during my PhD in and of itself. So that was really valuable. So I heard about it um, via email from the SRC. I was vaguely aware there was an internship scheme from the start of my PhD. And I thought it sounded interesting because I kind of had an eye out for emails about it. Uh, one of the most useful sort of general career skills I got out of it was working closely within a team. I think it also lets you find out what way you like working in, so whether working in a, I guess in a sense, a less independent way is something which uh, you take to more, whether the um, more, I guess in some ways, more isolated kind of academic working, some people really thrive off that. And there's massive pros and cons to each. I think it's partly an individual preference as to which way of working suits you more, um, but it's I think for anyone it's an incredibly important experience to have tried different ways of working before you make any long-term career decisions. I would absolutely encourage um, anyone to seriously consider doing an internship. Um, I think the main things to consider are how it will affect your PhD. So I think some internships are three months, some are six months, and that is quite a long time to take out. So um, it's good to sort of know a bit in advance that you're thinking of it and maybe build that consideration into your project, especially if you're running experiments and things. Um, but I personally found having a bit of time focusing on something else actually quite beneficial and coming back for the final year of my PhD um, I felt like I had a slightly different perspective and some new ideas so I wouldn't let the break per se put you off doing one. So if you're at the start of your PhD um, or even if you're in your second year um, I would really advise you to get in touch with the DTC if you want to know more about when internships might come up, check the website, check your emails talk to people who've done them, um, really find out all the information you can because it could be something that's uh, going to be really useful for your career.